How are you all? Today I'm going to make my homemade pizza since my children requested me to make today. So they're very happy and now I'm going to show you my dough ingredients. So now I have my one and a half uh, cup of wa warm water and two tablespoons of yeast, two tablespoons of sugar, five tablespoons of olive oil and one and a half teaspoon of salt. So now I'm going to mix the yeast. And the two tablespoons of sugar. Just mix it well and then keep aside for five minutes to activate the yeast. So now, see as you can see, it's already activated the yeast. So now I'm going to add three and a half cup of plain flour. So going to mix it now slowly. Some salt, one and a half teaspoon of salt. tablespoon of olive oil so now I'm going to mix together at least we can keep aside for one hour maximum so by the time I'm going to uh, mix this dough keep aside for one hour I'm going to show you my other ingredients of my pizza Now I'm, I'm going to add like uh, one tablespoon of olive oil in the bowl. Just brush it side to side. See? Just keep here. Then at least one hour maximum I can keep aside. So it's done. So I see it's now I keep aside for one hour. Now I'm going to show you my another recipe of my pizza. It's called chicken barbecue. I have to add this like one tablespoon of soy sauce. Some like half tablespoon of tea, uh, sugar, brown sugar. Okay, and a half uh, teaspoon of black pepper. So you can add together here. This brown sugar and the garlic powder, okay? Half teaspoon only. Just mix, mix it well. And now I have to add cut of lime, okay? So just squeeze here. So that's it. Thus, you can marinate for 10 minutes. Salat po nang nanonood dyan sa Pilipinas. In my home country also. What's my homemade pizza? So I cover for a while. For at least 10 minutes. So 
So now I'm going to make my own uh, homemade pizza sauce. So now I have uh, three lots of fresh tomato. I have to split into three parts, uh, four parts, see? Just split it here. So now I'm going to add the fresh tomato. Just boil it for 25 seconds only. Just too easy to peel up the skin. So okay, it's done already. My tomato is already boiled for 20 seconds. Now I have to peel up the skin. Easy to remove. See? So now I'm going to cut, cut it into thin pieces, but I, first I have to remove the seeds. Taking out the seeds, we will blend the tomato. See all the seeds here. So it's already done. Now I'm going to blend the tomato. Now let's start to fry my uh, sauce. So I have two tablespoons of butter. Yes. tablespoon of olive oil so now it's already melted the butter so I can add two medium size of onion you can use also a white onion just let it fry the onion Now I'm going to add two tablespoons of chopped garlic. Thin chop, okay? So now I'm going to add the fresh tomato paste, okay? Already blend, as you can see. Tablespoon of half teaspoon of black pepper and half teaspoon of chili flakes. So you add mix together. Mix it again. And one teaspoon of salt. And also I have two tablespoons of bell pepper, okay? Just to get flavor on my sauce. So mix it well. And now I'm going to add also 
टू टेबल स्पून ऑफ शुगर See, I have ketchup here. Three tablespoon. And now again, I have basil, uh, dried basil, half teaspoon, and oregano also, dried oregano, half teaspoon. So again, mix it together. Now just let it bubble a little bit. So now I, I add little bit two tablespoon of water, okay? Just to boil little bit. At least ten minutes to boil it and then finish. Done. So now the sauce is cooked already, so I make it to into puree, okay? So now I'm going to start that uh, chicken barbecue toppings, okay? So drop uh, one tablespoon of olive oil. So now I'm going to fry, fry the chicken. This chicken breast is very tender, so easy to cook also. So let it fry. Don't mix it now. Let it fry for at least two minutes. Then you can turn the chicken also. Lahat po dyan sa Pilipinas. Sarap tong ano. Sa homemade na pizza. Try nyo lang po. Madali lang naman pong gawin. So now I add one tablespoon of barbecue sauce just to add the flavor of charcoal taste, okay? Like a smoky, smoky charcoal flavor, okay? So mix it well. So already done. So that's it, see? So now, as you can see, it's already done the dough. It's one hour already. We have to take it out from the bowl now. Nicely, you have to mixing it do again, rolling it nicely again. The more we do like this, the more soft your pizza dough. And also, I'm not using a rolling pin, okay? I'm using my hand to make my dough. This dough is I'm making two pizza. So I have to cut it into half. One keep aside while I'm making the dough, the other one. Okay? Just keep aside and cover it for a while. So now I'm making the first pizza dough. Now. So I have to sprinkle some plain flour here so not to stick on the dough. Okay. So now done. Just yeah, slowly, slowly you have to press your finger slightly, not very hard. Bye. 
but we must have a patient to do this one because it's, it's not easy to do okay we must have a patient to do and I'm making a regular crush okay my pizza is I make a regular crush not very thin it's a regular So like this. But I'm going to put cheese on this edge of this uh, dough because my kids they love to have extra cheese on their pizza. So as you can see, I have to sprinkle here slowly, slowly. And rolling up like this. You can also do without cheese. You know, no, people know without cheese or plain like that is no problem. See, already done one pizza dough. So I'm going to show you later on to put my toppings. But before you put in the baking pan, you have to cook this dough. Now I have my baking pan here. I'm going to add a little bit plain flour so that we stick on this pizza dough. Slowly you can put that. You can show tighten it here for tighten it nicely, just for blocking it the mozzarella cheese so it won't come out. It will melt then. You can see. So done. So okay, it's already done the dough. Actually, I'm making two pizza. One is uh, meat pizza, pepperoni, and uh, other one I'm going to show you other one the ingredient. Okay, so let's start now my uh, pepperoni pizza. So let the drop, drop the sauce. According to y'all, how much you add your sauce? So done. So now I'm going to add the mozzarella cheese. Just sprinkle it slowly. And again, it's up to y'all how much cheese you can add. Now I will add the pepperoni. Nice done. So this is the second dough already made. So I have to add again the sauce. So it's 
done. So these are my ingredients of chicken barbecue with vegetable. Okay, I have already as you say or uh, I show you already my chicken barbecue. See the bell pepper here, cut in thin pieces, and some uh, olive olive here cut into thin pieces also some pineapple chunk already see already cut into small pieces some fresh onion also cut into small pieces so now it's done and you can bake for 200 degrees celsius and within 15 to 20 minutes okay to cook so it's done now we'll go to bake now is already my pizza is done so I already cut it into pieces also so now I'm going to show you okay, okay. so now we go to it's time to eat now my kids is already waiting for my pizza so bye for now hope you like my video